Hey everyone, so since it is Thursday, I thought I'd update you guys with my going dons For writing, I am on the first chapter, still on the first chapter, of my book. It is untitled. But I think the series title that I will be going with is, is Tales from Misty Falls. Let me know what you guys think of that title. And as I said before, I want it where most of the books, if not all, you could read individually. But they have like recurring characters, so it kind of ties together, you know. It's basically about a town with things that happen. My first book will deal with cryptids. And so far, my characters' names. I have named two characters, Guinevere and Sebastian. They are brother and sister. Guinevere has moved back, moved back to her hometown. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna set this place specifically. Obviously, this is a town that I'm making up. There could be a place called Misty Falls. There probably is. Um, but, you know, I'm not setting it in any one area. However, um, I, I guess you could place it somewhere in the Midwest. Um, specifically between, um, places like Illinois and Minnesota, places that I have lived personally. So, there will probably be some inspiration for that. Or from that, I should say. But basically, she has returned to her hometown. Oh, a squirrel. Sorry, I got distracted by the squirrel. Anyways, she's seen something on the news that made her move back. And all I can say is it has something to do with cryptids. I'm still figuring out the story as I go. But anyways, in the first chapter, she has just moved back. It is cold. It is nearing spring, but still freezing. Again, Minnesota inspired. And her brother has just found her a new couch. So that's where the story is right now. We are learning our characters' names, um, some of their interests, what is leading them to do the things that they're doing. And yeah, we're gonna go from there. We are gonna learn why Guinevere moved back what cryptids have to do with anything? And, you know, all the good stuff that comes with writing stories. <coughs> so that is where I'm at on the novel aspect. Um, poetry is going a little slow. I've come across a lot of great prompts and stuff. And ideas, it's just kind of, you know, putting that all into words and stuff. But I will most definitely be making a small zine of 30 poems. Some of them won't be very long. Um, it's probably going to be a lot of haiku and stuff. Let me know if you want to hear some of my new haiku. Or any of my new poems. But... I thought maybe 
a short video on, you know, haiku would be nice. Because those are fun to write. And they're often very pretty. My zine will be as colorful as possible. I'm going to say that now. As for reading, I have started a useless magic, um, which is lyrics and poetry by Florence Welch. Um, if you don't know who that is, that's the vocalist of Florence and the Machine, one of my absolute favorite bands of all time. I got to see them live, and they were fantastic. Um, but basically, it is a lot of Florence and the Machine lyrics. They have the albums, um, Lungs, Ceremonials, um, How Big, How Blue, How Beautiful, which is probably my favorite from them. It used to be Ceremonials. But Ceremonials got bumped down to second place. And then they have Highest Hope. Um, that was the last one before they, she made the book. And then I think the other half of the book is like original poetry. So I am enjoying that because I love their lyrics. I don't mind reading them. Even though some I've heard of songs in my head. I'm listening to The Scorch Trials, which is the second book in the Maze Runner series. I'm really liking that one. I am reading Unholy, which is the second book in the Unwind series. Um, Unwind has a very, very interesting um, premise. I'm, or I just started to now get into the, into the Eternal Editions of Sailor Moon that I had mentioned before. They're pretty much like the other ones, at least starting out, but, you know, it's Sailor Moon. I like Sailor Moon. So I've started those. Um... What else? What else am I reading? I'm reading and listening to a lot. Um, oh, I started the um, Final Girl Support Group. I've been kind of waiting to uh, read that one while I'm listening to it, but I count that as reading. It's not really capturing my attention in the same way that um, Horror Store or My Best Friend's Exorcism did. But, I'm sure it'll be just as interesting. I'm also reading The Adventures of Shrink Man, which, if I remember correctly, was originally supposed to be um, a Goosebumps book, but I guess he ended up just making it its own story. And I'm reading Son of Slappy, which is one of the Goosebumps Most Wanted stories. Um, I see. Yeah. And I know there's more, but I can't think of right now. I'm just kind of focusing on um, what I'm mainly reading. So that's how things are going. Let me know what you're reading. What you're writing, listening to, watching, etc. Thanks for watching, everybody. Bye bye.